guys. So big shout out to Lou Baca video. He actually gave me a shout out on Instagram for my 500 subscribers. He was like, congrats. So I'm going to put that up first because I need to give him some love. He's the man. Go check him out. So this is Lubo with Lou Baca video. And today I'm out on Lake Hartwell, yes, South sir. Carolina, fishing for stripers in hybrid. I am hosting Osni Fishing Adventures. That's Owen's channel out of York, PA. He's all about catch and release. So this fish is dedicated to Owen. I'm gonna let it go. Go check him out and hit that like button. Subscribe to his channel. Congratulations to Owen on hitting 500 subscribers. Lubaka out. What is up guys? It is Osni Fishing Adventures and guess what guys? Today I am fishing a brand new creek brand new water and the water is gin clear or almost gin clear the funny thing is from all this rain we've been having this new water is actually very high and it is going fast but the funny thing is it looks relatively clear now this is a smaller tributary actually to the east branch of the Kedoris. there's many branches or tributaries to the east branch but i heard rumors about this one that this one's supposedly amazing and it's a secret gem so you know what? We're going to test that theory out today. Make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet, and make sure you hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload because you definitely do not want to miss this one. I always say that every video, but you don't want to miss this one either. So let's get right into it. All right, guys, this creek is starting to show a lot of signs of life because look at this deep. There's a long, long, deep pocket, and that goes into those rapids down there. There we go. That's it. Oh! Oh, I got him. I got him. I got him. Trout, 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 trout. That is what I'm looking for. It looks like a brookie. Yeah, it's a brook. No, it's a brownie. Brown trout. All right, guys. First one of the day. That makes me happy. First trout of the day. Now, it is a stocky because this is a stock stream, but this looks like an awesome looking stream. Probably holds some monster fish. There we go. Oh, that is an awesome brown trout right there. wet my hands. Oh, that water is nice and cold. There he goes. It's chewing down there for now. All right, guys, so on this next trout, it was the golden palomino, and it was my first ever. It took me a whole hour to get it to bite. This, this palomino was not hungry whatsoever, but I had to get it to bite. So I got the perfect drift, finally, and he took it, and it was a lot of fun. Let's get right into the footage. Got him. Got him. Got him. Yeah, got him. <laughs> yep. Oh crap, he's stuck on the log. Oh good, 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 got him. There we go. There we go. I got the Palomino. I got Mr. Palomino. Oh, oh, oh. No, do not leave me. I want my first Palomino ever. You will not leave me. Yes. Yes. What an awesome looking fish, guys. This is the first time I've ever caught... Oh! Oh! Keep him in the water. I'm gonna try to, at least. Never caught a golden palomino before. That is awesome looking. Look at that. Oh! He still has a lot of energy. I can tell you that. He did not get away, boys. He did not get away. Look at that. He will cooperate and let me get a good picture. Come on. Let me show you to the camera. Awesome looking fish. Look at that gold color on the top of them. Look at that awesome fish. Awesome fish, boys. All right, guys, I really want to check out those rapids, but there's trout right here, so I really want to stay here. You know what I mean? All right, guys, we got a nice little slot right here, and we got a nice little slot up ahead, and we got a nice little slot probably. Next time, guys, I'm just going to walk all the way downstream coming here. This looks like a really productive creek. It's always cold. Look at that water. I'm not sure where this cold water is coming from. This has to be a below 50. This has to be in the low 60s or below 50. Has to be. With this steam coming off it, just has to be. There we go. That a wild, that's a wild brown trout. You gotta be kidding me. Look at that. That's a little wild brown. Wait, let me get my net out. I don't want to hurt this guy. Let's keep him in the water. Where's my net? It's over here. Wow, that's a wild brown trout right there. Look how small he is. Should be able to get in the water right here. Get in here, buddy. There we go. Just wanna, you know, keep this guy in the water and do everything you're supposed to do for trout etiquette. That's a beautiful trout. That's definitely a wild brown trout right there. Look at that. 
very small. It's a very small trout, but man, is he beautiful. Look at that. Awesome looking wild brown. Look at that beautiful wild brown, guys. So small. But these fish are so beautiful. He could go right back. This water's so cold, guys. He'll be fine. Believe me, you don't even need to revive these fish. Just ran into this hole. Might as well fish it. Ooh. That, oh, he came back for it. He came back. Oh, no. Oh, no, he's right there. <laughs> that looked like a rainbow. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my. Got to always watch out for that. These stockies are aggressive. Came right back for it. Trout rose, guys, right in front of me. There he is, there he is. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. That looks like another brown trout. Looks like another brown trout. There we go, guys, I hooked up. We hooked up into another trout. That's what I'm talking about. All right. They must be stocking a lot of brownies in here or something. I don't know what it is. Look at that. That's probably the best one of the day right there. Awesome looking wild brown. All right, guys, I know those aren't wild browns. This is actually before I figured out those fish weren't wild browns. Because the difference between wild browns and stockfish, actually, is you see how the dots are kind of like jumbled together and they're not separate? That's usually a pretty good sign that they're not wild browns. And plus, the dots were orange. They weren't, you know, bright red. If they're wild brown, they're bright red. Like, you know, the, the second fish I caught, the second trout, that little one? That was definitely a wild brown because it had bright red spots on it and it had a little gold on its belly. That's how you know they're wild. Guys, sadly this fish choked it, but he should be fine. He should be fine. That will eventually disintegrate. All right, come on. Alrighty. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, this, is, this hole is stacked. This is stacked to the max. Oh my goodness. You see in this, guys? every single cast like two seconds later every single cast i am putting in gets hammered absolutely destroyed oh, i really don't want to leave right now come on light i want this light to stay up because once it gets too dark i can't record my gopro and then it doesn't work as well i am getting so much blow ups right now there we go there we go a rainbow trout we got a rainbow on now guys holy smokes this this hole is stacked man that is a beautiful trout that is some awesome colors on it oh yeah hopefully i didn't hook this one deep oh gosh he is not ready actually he's coming in <laughs> oh oh my oh my calm down little buddy little buddy buddy where are you going that's an awesome looking trout Oh, he's got a lot of energy, I can tell you that. <clears throat> well, there's our first different trout species other than a brown for the day. Oh, almost had him. Come on, get in it. Get in it. Oh, there we go. Oh, goodness. Gosh. Oh, that's a beautiful fish. All right, try to keep this guy in the water. That's what I always like to do with trout. Calm down. Jeez. All right. Good. Through the hook awesome looking rainbow oh my gosh that is a beautiful fish now it's obviously a stocky though because look at the peck fins he has none oh goodbye all right guys i am not disappointed in that trip i had a fun time here guys i am so excited i got out of here before nightfall this was really easy like i was easily able to access the trails this is an awesome setup really and it looks like to me nobody's been here for a while there wasn't any boot marks no nothing this creek is high and running, but the thing is, it's clear. So these trout are able to see, and obviously they were able to see my worm. I mean, they absolutely destroyed it. These might be stockies, but I, I catch in a few wild browns, I'm not even going to lie. Some of those fish were wild browns, especially that one really dinky one that I caught. That was absolutely a wild brown. These are still nice quality fish. I'm happy about this place, and I'm definitely making a return. All right, guys, so before I end this video, I want to let everybody know, next week, Monday, 6 p.m., giveaway video. I'm going to have all the hats on there. I'm going to show you everything in the giveaway and they're actually sitting right over there if you didn't notice. 
Five of them are mine, and five of them are given away. So make sure you stay in touch, and I'll see you next Monday. Good luck to everybody. Osni out.